The New York Times best-selling author is in Dallas today to learn about a local nonprofit that transforms preschools and to also share the story of her unusual path to becoming educated. Our Brooke Katz has a story that you will see only right here on CBS 11. Tara Westover wrote this book, Educated, about her upbringing by survivalist parents in rural Idaho. Today, she toured Hamilton Park Learning Center to find out what a local nonprofit is doing to prepare our children for school and for life. Hi, everyone. You have a visitor. She never stepped foot in a school until the age of 17. But today, Tara Westover's <laughs> life surrounds education. I think everybody gets brought up with certain ideas and certain perspectives, and I think Part of what it means to get an education is to get access to other points of view and then decide what you think. The 33-year-old's father forbade schools, yet she educated herself and went on to BYU, Harvard, and Cambridge. What Tara's story really does reflect is that there aren't any bad experiences and that everything in our life really is a learning experience. One Sunday morning, the school the Westover visited is one of more than a hundred for which Educational First Steps provides mentoring, training, and enrichment. The idea is to elevate daycares in at-risk neighborhoods to national accreditation status. I'm drawn to education and institutions that support education, especially for younger kids. I think I think the earlier you start, the easier it is, obviously. Westover will also speak at Educational First Steps annual fundraiser tonight, sharing a story that seems to resonate regardless of background. I hope also that it's that whole question of what education is and what it means to grow up and change your mind and um, try to participate in the making of your own mind in some way. Brooke Rogers, CBS 11 News.